Today we're going to talk about how to befriend uh, a Rottweiler, how to win their trust, how to become uh, the pack leader, and how to desensitize these guys. Um, first of all, if you're getting a Rottie, you want to make sure that you have uh, established that you are someone that can be a pack leader, you want to be a alpha, let me see over here. You want to establish yourself as the alpha. Uh, you, I've said it before, you might get away with being a beta, but never, never do you want to have the omega attitude. Um, you don't want to be an easy uh, going rollover kind of person. You do have to be stern with these guys, but you can't be mean to these guys either. Um, when I first got Kaya, she had a lot of anxiety and today we're going to take her uh, to do some human socialization as well around humans and, and uh, city life cars trucks etc uh, i'm just going to point out that the whole entire time that i'm talking to you i'm petting her and uh, basically building her confidence up this is where you uh, solidify your bond with with these dogs particularly rottweilers and you know these larger guardian type they tend to have a, a stubborn streak and they can uh, challenge you from time to time if you let them get away with it one time they're so smart that they will remember that you are not the alpha and they lose respect for you however that does not mean you have to be mean, tough, big, bad, whatever. Just the attitude, assertiveness, and oh, sweetie, no, no. Now, how I'm desensitizing her is when I first got her, she would not let you pet her or hold, get this close to her. And um, there, there were certain little spots on her body, particularly her paws, that she would not let you touch. So now I'm going to touch her paws and see if she, oh, she's doing really good. Over the last, the course of the last uh, six days, I've been praising her, telling her she's a good girl, and um, just desensitizing her to the touch. And every time she jerks, she's jerking away there, kind of scared. Oh, good girl, that be okay. Talk to her, deep voice. Oh, you're okay. Oh, oh, oh. Continue to talk to her. I treat them with hot dogs, but I pre-soak these guys because I hate the sodium content and I try to get the lowest sodium hot dog. No, no, gotta wait. 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 No, no, you gotta wait. No. Now I'm putting it right in front of No. 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 And I'm basically teaching her how to wait and how to respect the fact that if I don't give her the command to take it, she just can't take it. And the command is just good girl, good girl. Basically that's every time she, she hears good girl, it, she relates that to a good thing. So uh, when she's upset and you tell her good girl, oh no, be good girl, oh. And she instantly remembers that in her mind that hey, I remember if I do this, I get that. Anyway, so we will end that here. She's doing real good every day. I just saw uh, slowly. Uh, get her to trust the, the touch of me and, and my wife uh, to where she bonds. Uh, a little bit uh, more about her history was we got her from these folks uh, in Yakima, Washington. And they did tell us she uh, was showing some signs of aggression, um, um, so forth. I'm, I'm realizing that it wasn't really their fault. It, it, they live out in the country she wasn't properly socialized and she's very intelligent she she demands um that leadership that that constant challenge and, and that i know that about her i i train her as much as i can every day continually to desensitize her praise her and so forth if you have a rottweiler out there uh pitbull german shepherd or you know one of the doberman that sort of guardian type dog, uh, 
pit bull not really a good guardian however that type of a strong-willed type dog you do have to be a assertive kind but the main thing is uh, develop trust <laughs> play with them wrestle with them ah, I did good girl and then I got her to uh, uh, get used to my hand around her mouth and this is where I started brushing her teeth with uh, the force the brush and so forth and so now we're starting to brush her teeth she's uh, being really uh, oh good girl being positive about that yes sweetie good all right thank you much for tuning in the next video will probably take her and do some uh, socialization type training at maybe Winco or Walmart or some grocery store where there might be more people. Thanks again.